and I've been exploited on Pornhub for the past 12 to 13 years. There are two videos of me online uploaded by somebody that I was friends with for about 10 years. I have not been able to get justice because there's no laws in my state. I've now turned to advocating and doing this full time because it's changed my entire life. I have PTSD, anxiety, depression, an eating disorder, and a sleeping disorder. I was very suicidal at first but I've had a lot of help. And there's a lot out there that we can offer to survivors that should know, like, you know, that they're not alone. Caitlin, first off, I, I wanna thank you for being here because it would be easier not to. Right. Tell me how you found out these videos were online because I want people to realize this could be going on and they don't even know it. Right, and that was pretty much my case. Um, I found out May in 2020, I was over a friend's house and my two friends said, hey, remember so-and-so from high school? And I'm like, well, of course I do. He goes, oh, he has an account on Pornhub. And I just looked at my friends, I'm like, I'm on there. And they're like, no, you're not, no, you're not. I said, I agreed to one video. I know he didn't delete it. I know he didn't. I was 18, I'm 32 now. Um, a week later, on May 28, 2020, my friends sat me down and they said, yep, we searched in the first two videos on her, his account review. Okay, and when you say you agreed to it, let's be real clear yeah. about this. You didn't agree to make this for d dissemination. Uh, it was for him. This was for him. He was gonna go to college. He mm -hmm. said, I'd like to have mm -hmm. something to remember you by, blah, 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 blah. Yep. But you didn't agree that, hey, you're gonna become a distributor. I, I wanna make this, I agree to make this for you so you can send it right. out to the world. Right, nope, not at all. And these were titled with your name. And, and that's the one with the most views, the one that's been distributed the most, and the one that's made him the most money. When you looked this up and saw uh, that it was there, and and actually it went beyond that one website, it oh, yeah. had been picked up other places, mm -hmm. and you say it averaged almost a million views all the places that it had been. Over five million. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, how did that hit you? What was your reaction? I'm on over 45 websites, five other countries, and so far I counted up to five million and I stopped counting. Because you have to, you have to stop looking, you have to stop researching, sometimes it's hard not to. I had to deal with losing friends, I had to deal with losing family members. Um, I quit my job recently to advocate for this because it's ruined my entire life. I'm now, two years ago, I thought I was gonna kill myself and now I'm on Dr. Phil, so I think I'm doing something good here. <laughs> yeah, well that's a lot better than thinking about taking your own life, because no. that's, that's giving your power away to that person that exploited you and that's the worst possible thing you could do. So I'm glad you got through that moment and I'm damn sure glad you're here. Thank you. Uh, instead of that. Um, uh, Caitlin says she met with a detective. There are no laws uh, in her state and they said, there's just nothing you can do. Not really. I called lawyers, I called hotlines, I got laughed at, I got told there's nothing we can do in Massachusetts, you know, there's no laws here. So I, I was like, I'm not gonna give up. This is still wrong. This is human rights, these are my rights. This is my privacy. My privacy and safety were stolen from me because of this person, because of whatever his reason is, it doesn't matter. And I did confront him the day I found out and he admitted to it. So I have his admission, I, you know, I went to court, I, the case was dismissed this year because there wasn't enough, I guess, there's no laws and the way that the report was written up didn't have enough, I guess, details. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.